Hi everyone and welcome to our channel. Today's video is regarding our monthly cost of living for JM and myself here in Dipolog City, Mindanao. So let's go through all that and enjoy. Don't go away. Okay, you probably remember the last video I did on the cost of living uh, and that was in July 2020 and now you can see the figures on the screen uh, things hasn't changed that much although because I guess my rent went down by 2,000 pesos uh, let's compare some other prices from last year Yeah, for instance, the price of petrol has gone approximately 14% up since last year, uh, July 2020. And then uh, I'm going to show you all those items, uh, price fluctuation uh, from last year in the supermarket. Let's have a look at that. Uh, honestly, I haven't seen a major price increase since last year, as many people mentioned. And so it's looking pretty good. Okay, let's have a look at today's grocery bag. Um, we have a dishwashing um, all the washing stuff, detergent softener uh, we got here some sardine um, tissue we got some powder mango to make some juices uh, some packing things this is small bags that we usually use to put food sm very small tiny bags when we eat chicken and we put the inside and then we throw in the trash otherwise it's going to smell um, I got some mouthwash here <clears throat> a couple of uh, tiger light tiger milk some uh, biscuit with no chocolate no sugar stuff on top um, we got some cream I don't know something for JM to make some cake I got some beans here which I like to have a little some at breakfast now some pasta now we're gonna do another gratin refined sugar this is to make cake spread to put on the sandwich fast noodle not for me that's for JM she loves it um, toilet paper we got some uh, black olives so we're gonna can put that on top of a pizza this is JM stuff I don't know uh, pickle relish cream for the cakes uh, bread nice uh, wholemeal bread uh, some more rubbish uh, sorry I mean <laughs> fast fast noodle stuff and uh, with everything you see here so I'll show you again I didn't go price on each item but the total comes to 1806 pesos so I just show here slowly if you want to have a look later okay so that would be the indi individual price for each item if you want to have a look you can pause maybe and anyway so that's what it is this is one grocery bag and uh, obviously there's a few of those like that in a month and uh, we're gonna sit and work it out so that'll give you a good idea um, 
what we buy. Um, next grocery bag in two, three days time will probably be different, but it just give an idea. Yeah, that's nice. One kilo, yeah. One hundred. Just put on the fry pan. On the fry pan. Wait, alive? Wait. Alive? <laughs> Salam? Uh, one kilo. One kilo. One kilo. Okay. Oh. What is, what is it? Tanduai. Oh, Tanduai. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's too hot. Thank you, Pat. It's too hot. Too hot. You, 100. Huh? 100. No, it's too hot. Hey. One shot. It's too hot, man. If I drink this, <laughs> outside so hot. Is that your husband? No, that's a friend. Hmm? Friend. Friend. Oh. Friend. How about that? Another bag. So how much is that? One o five. One hundred five. Uh, however, don't think that um, buying grocery and eating at home is the cheapest way. Not always, because we like to spoil ourselves uh, to make those delicious dishes that we miss, like the one you see on the screen right now. Perhaps uh, eating at an eatery uh, is probably the cheapest way to go about. Eating in a restaurant can be up to seven to ten times more expensive than in an eatery. So we only go say maybe uh, once a month. As entertainment, other than going to restaurant, we enjoy very much joyride and discover new places, beaches, swimming pool and parks and explore new places. Okay, on your screen now, it's um, the monthly cost of living uh, that I did for July 2020. Um, now, let's have a look at the new monthly cost of living for August 2021, which is roughly uh, just over a year. Now, the groceries... Um, hasn't changed much at all really just a little bit fraction just a fraction over but not much uh, the list come down from 11,000 to 9,000 utilities uh, electricity and water is pretty much the same transport has gone up a little bit as the fuel price has gone up however we don't go out on joyride as often as before but still have the weekly trip to the mountain house, JM's parents. So it's pretty much the same, just a little bit higher. Immigration is up 2,830 pesos for two month visa. Internet is pretty much the same. I'm very happy with 30 mega uh, pixel per second. Um, it, it's pretty good. I mean, you guys can see our live stream and it's reliable unless we got some power issue. Entertainment has gone up. Um, we, we're going out a bit more often and doing more things with JM, so that's gone up. Cable TV is gone. Now I can watch all that free on internet. Medication is pretty much the same price. Hypertension tablet, but price has gone up on medication, so still about the 2000 mark. Now, still no local health insurance or motorbike insurance. I know I should, but I still don't have that. So you guys may want to add that. A motorbike insurance is about 10,000 pesos a year. Uh, so health insurance, so I'm waiting a little bit. I'm waiting a month or two. So the total is 39,229 pesos. Uh, so that's 729 US dollar compared to 761 of last year. There's not much difference, guys. So I don't know why people say that um, 
uh, price has gone up a lot although may I say that uh, land price has gone up I know because I've been looking at land a long while ago and uh, I would say probably a good 10% if no more okay now building houses I don't know but that would have probably gone up as well our lifestyle is not um, a uh, great I mean it's not rich people it's not also poor people it's a really standard lifestyle we enjoy very much and this is what we need as a minimum uh, to live you guys may want to spend more money if you want to buy a shirt every week or a pair of shoes every week or but we we don't do that we don't do that and uh, that's already included in the groceries um we may buy a shirt a month or maybe a pair of shoes every two months and traveling uh, at the moment we can't travel much uh, with airlines so to tourist destination so it doesn't show here yet so anyway that's what it is if you got any question about it just please let me know or something you may not agree with that's fine let me know in the meantime thank you for watching this video and until the next video Take care all. God bless you all. Bye-bye.